Hey guys, how are y'all doing out there? Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night, good twilight, good whatever it is where you are. It's a girl Twin D. I'm right here. And welcome to the camp. If you're new here, big up yourself. My longtime subscribers, thank you so so much for always being here. And you know the drill. Big up on yourself, enough respect, and thank you all for the continuous support. Thanks to everyone who's sending me donations using the thank you button underneath my video, purchasing my bath and body products. And also my jewelry. Big ups to Uno. Love you guys. Thank you so much for the support. You know you guys really support me. And I really love it. That's why I always try to be here for you. So let's jump into your messages. And see what's going on. Our Father who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. For that is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. All right, guys, let's jump in. And if you're new here, yes, I do say my prayer at the beginning of every single message. That's how I make sure my messages are coming from the right place. And guess what? That I'm also protected and covered while doing this. You know, so let's go. Stick around if you want to know more. Okay, let's see what's going on for us. We're looking at what's coming in for us within the next three days. And I am looking at love in regards to love. And this could be for twin flames, soulmates, or someone you know. Anybody, really. So let's see what's coming in for us within the next three days in regards to love here. What's coming in for the God in regards to love for us within the next three days. Or whenever you say. <laughs> You got intuition and manifestation. So some of you guys will be manifesting something here. There's something that you're thinking about. There's something that you're planning. There's something that you want to achieve. For some, it's a house. It's a house and whatever you are trying to manifest in regards to this house, it's coming through. It seems like you have the protection and the guidance here of of. The whole three spirits in one. Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Okay. You have your protection. And everything that you are manifesting, it's coming through. Whatever it is that you have your mindset on, that you've been working towards, that you've been longing for. Sometimes you even gave up. Sometimes you even gave up. But you came back to the idea. And right now, things are going to start to come together. You got a loving woman. So there's someone coming towards you here as well. Whoever this is, this person is going to treat you right. This person is going to love you right. Hey, you got commitment coming in. I love to see this one. So there's commitment coming in for some of us. And it's all threes on the board. You got three, six, three. So whatever is happening, like I said before, in regards to this manifestation, you have God's support. It's like whatever you're wishing for, you're hoping for, you're working on trying to manifest. Yeah, it's like God is saying, go ahead, go ahead. Some of you will be achieving this high sense of um, spirituality in regards to this loving woman. It's like you're being transformed. Something, again, in regards to how you've been working on yourself is going to be coming into fruition. And you're going to achieve that spiritual level that you've been working on. Optimism. You're waking up. You're waking up. There's a new beginning. There's a new start. You are done with the negative thinking. You are done thinking that nothing ever is going to work out. Maybe that's why you stopped um, working on your ideas. Maybe that's why you weren't wishing for love anymore. You weren't wishing for that house anymore. You weren't wishing for that car anymore. You weren't trying to change anymore. But you're about to be fulfilled. What else is coming for us within the next three days here? You got a creative endeavor. So some of you will definitely be going out here. Whatever it is you're going out for, it is something that's going to bring you your true happiness. 
It's going to take you back to what you're used to doing, to what you love to do. This is how you come into being yourself. And it's going to start. Some of you going on a trip. Some of you will be going to this music thing that's here. Some of you are going back to painting, drawing, um, photography. Uh, that's not how it's pronounced. Photography. It's, it's taking you back to your, to your true self. A lot of you have been trying to get back into your true self for a long time, but it, it, it wasn't working out. It wasn't working out, yep. It wasn't working out, and that's because of some fear that was placed onto your life. There was some fear that was placed onto your life, but now you're stepping out of that box. Now you're removing that energy. You're working on yourself. And like I said, it is that support. So now you have God's support. Which is why you're removing yourself from that fearful energy. That massive change is about to happen. And you got professional assistance. So you are also making some changes in your life here. You'll be making some major changes. Some of you will be having some court issues here that you need to deal with. Some of you will be signing contracts. Some of you will be buying something here that is very, very, um, not really expensive, but um, important to you, important to your life. Hence the situation with the house. And I'm getting that house very, very strongly. So whatever is happening here, it's going to be leading you to the love that you're looking for. And I thought this was going to be like a love for yourself. I mean, a partner love. But this is a, a message here about that self-love energy. You getting back into yourself, loving yourself. And it's going to bring you everything that you dreamed of. Yeah, back and forth. Like I said, you weren't sure what you wanted to do. So you had forgotten or given up. On what your plans were. Another five. So it's five, seven, five out here. So guys, please look up these numbers, guys. They're always talking to us, trying to tell us what we need to do. But that back and forth energy, that not knowing what to do, that indecisiveness, it's about to change. It's about to change. So you're making your intentions clear. Some of you have been praying hard to get back into into um into yourself to be happy again to start to love yourself again and your prayers are about to be answered and you got playing it safe yeah you got family Ooh. and what's in the middle dark thoughts so during this time guys pay attention to your consciousness pay attention to your thoughts pay attention to everything that's coming towards you. Because like I said. Oh new beginning is under dark thoughts. You see. It's your thoughts that I've always tried to keep you back. It's your thoughts. So you're being attacked. Your thoughts are being attacked. And that's why you always thought. That nothing good will ever happen. But because you've been praying. You've been staying strong. Now everything is being uh, revealed. Now everything is coming to light and you're finally receiving the help you need. That's why God says never stop praying, you know, until something happens. Because it, it just shows like how much you really, really want what you're praying for. Did I only just want it for the moment that I thought about it? Or did I just want it? Uh, because it's a thought. Or is it something that's going to help me? So I want it and I'm working towards it and I'm not going to stop until I achieve it. Keep going. Keep going. Your prayers are about to be answered. Let's see what else is coming for us here. You have the, the lady. This charming woman with flowers in hand, as with the gentleman, her cards will command. The fortunes revealed once the cards have been placed, unveil the faith. That destiny traced. So you see what I'm saying, guys? Everything that has been set out for you, that God planned for you, that you God wanted for you, it's about to come into fruition. It's about to. Let's see what else is here. You got the birch rod. 
Birchwood brings strife to what should be bliss. To husband and wife all has gone amiss. Prepare for a sorrow that dampens the day. Begotten of quarrels that bring much dismay. So like I, I also saw with these professional assistants. Yeah, there may definitely be some court issues that's coming up here as well. And for some of you, this is something that you wanted to do for a while because you've been so unhappy. You've not been happy with where you are and you've been trying to make this decision and it seems you're about to take that step. It seems you're about to take that step and you have flowers. Happiness anew from the flowers scent. The outlook for you means encouragement. Days will be filled with pleasures come true. Faith has so will the best unto you. You see what I'm saying? After all these struggles that you're going through, yeah, all of that has to be completed. And now it's time for you to receive what you've always dreamed and prayed for. Because it's what God said, destiny. That's what faith said. That's how it's going to happen. Now is the time. And you got crossroads. A road in the open reveals the best way. Choose wisely your path to avoid any dismay. Follow your dreams. You hear that? Follow your dreams with faith and precision. All will be clear once you've made your decision. You see what I'm saying, guys? So you see why these messages can never be wrong. All these messages are talking about faith. It is time. But you got to make the decision. And what did I say? What's happening? You're being manipulated. It's like the enemy is playing on your thoughts, trying to keep you stuck. But do not give in. Don't give in. And you got the book. The, un the unopened book weaves stories concealed. When pages are read, the truth is revealed. The book guards tales of inner emotion. Blessed are the words of deep devotion. There's a brand new beginning here. There's a new start. And again, this is something you're going to find out. This is something that you're going to be working towards because it is what you've always desired. And it's going to come to you. Hey, well, thank you very much. <laughs> Cavalier. Heed well good news from the Cavalier. Impassioned views, impassioned views promise good cheer. Sadness that hides veiled in the day, once disguised, soon flies away. The sadness is going to be removed, guys. There's definitely happiness on its way to you and someone is coming into you as well. There's a brand new beginning. Your happiness is on the way. Your love life is about to improve too. Everything you've planned and dreamed of, whatever uh, idea that you had, You've been working on it. You may not have seen any kind of um, improvement, but it's on its way. It's coming to you right now, and you're finally going to achieve the love that you've been longing for. Yeah, man, keep praying. Keep praying, guys, because your prayers are about to be answered. Love you guys. Take care of yourselves out there. Let go and let God. And I'll see you at your next message later, guys. Love you all. Let go and let God.